Hi, I'm Sophie. And I'm Catherine from TLC's DC Cupcakes. And we're here today with TLC.com's Holiday Hostess series. And we're gonna show you that holiday entertaining for Halloween doesn't have to be scary. We're gonna be making our new candy bar cupcakes. We're gonna make 12 different flavors using one recipe. Let's get started. So the first step is going to be to preheat your oven to 350 degrees and to line your cupcake pan. We're gonna start with two and a half cups of sifted all-purpose flour. And to this, we're gonna add a half a teaspoon of baking powder and then a quarter teaspoon of salt. Our next step is adding one stick of unsalted butter to your mixer. And then we're gonna add one and three quarter cups of granulated sugar. If you don't have a stand mixer at home, it's not a problem. You can use a hand mixer and a regular mixing bowl. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cream the butter and the sugar for around five minutes until it's light and fluffy and at medium speed. Okay, this looks great. Perfect, okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is add two large eggs to our batter. Pour one yolk in at a time. Perfect, and then we're gonna mix it until it's incorporated into the batter. Okay, we're ready for the next egg. Okay. You wanna make sure to always scrape down your bowl. Wipe down the paddle and then just scrape down the sides and make sure the bottom is totally scraped up. Now we're ready to add the wet and dry ingredients. So we're gonna start by taking one and a quarter cups of whole milk at room temperature again, and we're gonna add two and a quarter teaspoons of pure vanilla extract. Add this to our milk, perfect, okay. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna alternate our flour mixture and in our, mi in our milk. And it's important to alternate the dry and the wet and not overload your batter by pouring all the flour in because you've created all these little air bubbles when you're creaming your butter and sugar together. And the last thing we want to do is collapse them. Otherwise, your cupcakes are going to come out like bricks and be really dense and dry. Whereas if you do it this way, it'll be light and fluffy. So it's really important to do it this way. So two thirds of the flour is in now. Okay, set up. Add a little more milk. And then the rest of the flour goes right in. Perfect, great. I like to get everything out. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> One last mix on low speed. Low, here we go. So the batter's ready and we're ready to scoop it. Okay, great. I'm gonna take the paddle off, grab our cupcake pan. And in our bakery, we use an ice cream scoop and this makes sure that every cupcake is leveled off to the same amount and they all bake evenly. Perfect. Okay, so now for the fun part, adding the Halloween candy. My favorite are the peanut butter cups. These are delicious. Mm. <laughs> Don't eat them. Okay. So I'm gonna add this right into the batter. Great, there we go. And you can take a knife or a fork you have at home and just mix up the candy bar bits right into the batter so it's nice and incorporated. And you're gonna do this with each of the 12 candy bars, so each cupcake will be a different candy bar flavor. What's your favorite? Toffee bar. Toffee bar is next. Yep. Mm. Stop eating them, seriously. Oh, good. good choice, Sophie. Okay, so it looks like we're all done. We're gonna put it in the oven at 350 degrees for 15 to 18 minutes. We always recommend checking them at 15 minutes, put in a toothpick, if it comes out clean, then it's ready. Okay. In they go. Okay, they look ready. Cool. Oh, they those look, good. look fabulous. Mm -mm -mm. Great, now we're just gonna let these cool and we're gonna prepare our buttercream frosting to go on top. 